CMR arrested Chris's femininity. Oh yes, there is no case for this. There are no judges. There are no juries. But there are lots of evidence and lots of witnesses. I'm Lady Fine and I'm a witness. If you don't know, I host a dating show live right here every Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Jamaica time. Let's get into this. Let me start this off by saying that Chrissy is fully capable of being feminine and submissive, but not to CMR. He ruined it. The butterfly them in our belly have completed their life cycle. In their earlier videos, you could tell that she was in love with him. You could see it. She saw him as her man. And people talk about the way she talks to him, but she didn't always talk to him like that. But over time, she lost respect for him. And when respect is gone, you may as well throw everything else out the window. Chrissy is feminine. She dresses well, she cooks, she cleans. She wants to be submissive, but you don't just become submissive. The man has to make you feel safe and provided for, and you will just naturally fall into submission. And don't get hung up on the word submission. It's only a bad thing if you give it to the wrong person. They had an argument a few weeks ago, and this is when I knew for sure submission is next to impossible. I am going to play the video. It's a minute and a half long. We'll discuss it afterwards. Got you. And one thing me know in a life, when you become certain people towards people, when your time has come, you got you, you see? Oh, me never know that. But me, that me assure you, but it no matter to me. All right, you know? Me and go my life, you need to leave me life. She know where she had to shit me. Cool like what me I say is, what me I say is, everybody. From them I tell you, like just like go on, I know some 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 I know She not do me nothing. So why me? If, why me? If, why me? If mad with her? She not do me nothing. No, she not do me nothing. She talk bad about me before. Chat. She talk bad about me before. Then then she talk about me before. But me no business. Look when people talk about me, add them for my life same way. Once me know. Only people and don't tell you after. When you play other people and then tell you. When then that tell us again and text you. Why you don't listen? My phone did this up or some of this up. My thing is, my thing is. People are support you. My thing is, my thing is, my thing is. When people have got through their situation, you not rip them down too. Year. Okay, what but me never be seen. But me never be Don't seen. Don't do that for life, cause me, everybody else. When you, you do know, when you do know, I create this for when, the life, so you, people can record. Yes, they're supposed to record. You can listen. You cannot no, come no, see some, people. You come make a big major out of me thing. You all there for the wait till my life done. You talk to me then, you know. One more clout. You gotta make people screen record, man. Now. After I saw that. I knew submission was gone and probably not coming back. CMR is the one preventing Chrissy from being soft and delicate with and around him. You do not bring out the femininity in her because you are not masculine, at least not enough for her. She's masculine because she doesn't feel safe enough to be feminine. And you know, the breakdown happened last year. Chrissy strikes me as the type that would work on things and ride the wagon until the wheels fall off. I think that it wasn't about the affair because I think she knew. At least she had an inkling. She, she knew something was up. I'm convinced. She may not be able to put her finger on it, but I'm convinced she knew something was happening. But I think it was the disrespect that got to her. It was how sloppy it was done. He didn't handle it like a man. He didn't handle it with respect. He didn't handle business. Sir, you did not handle your business. And I think that is what that got her. Look at this and tell me if you agree. My husband is a thousand percent wrong with everything we do. Every single thing. It's not even about the sex. It's more so about the conversations. You know how 
conversations or receipts. I don't want to speak on this. I'm going to stop. This is not a one night stand something, you know. This is a whole different relationship. You bring a girl in Orlando that we live paying for hotels. And every time I go on the road to buy stuff, you complain about money. You're a failure to me and the kids. You're a failure to people that support you. You are a failure. You are. When your woman sees you as a failure, it's over for you. It's difficult to come back from that. She doesn't see him as her hero. Like, she should see him as her Superman. Like, every woman should see their man as their Superman. And if you don't see a man as your Superman, you probably need a new man. And I can help you with that. We go live every Sunday, 7.30 p.m. Jamaica time. Let me help you find a man that will be your Superman. I've never done nothing to my husband more than I speak disrespectfully, yes, but I've never done nothing to him. I take care of this man. If Kushian had hurt him, it's my problem. Nobody cares about him but me, nobody. I put this man before myself. When I share dinner, I share him and the kids them and I'm like, I'll eat whatever. You don't do nothing. You never grow, do nothing. I'm a cook. Clean everything I me do. You close them, you don't know you close them wash. You don't know nothing is done. Nothing is done. Oh, Chrissy. What if I tell you that respect is the main ingredient? It weighs more than all the other things. I'm sure most men would swap any of those things for respect. They would rather a woman that respect him, but she doesn't clean. Or she respects him, but she doesn't do laundry. He would prefer she respects him and she doesn't cook. They prefer respect. It's the biggest one. And it's the biggest one that you don't have. But you cannot respect someone that gives you all the reason in the world to have no respect for them. You cannot be submissive and feminine to someone you do not respect. So CMR, he wants her to be feminine and submissive towards him, but he gives her no reason to respect him. It's a catch-22, and that's one of the most interesting things I find about them. You, you, you can't you can't do that you want her to be feminine and, and submissive but you give her no reason to respect you and she can't be feminine and submissive if she doesn't respect you and listen every man wants their woman to be feminine and submissive to them even cmr you don't believe me watch this video yo don't bumbo clear what me if you say yes babes so that was him telling a girl to say, yes, babes, not what. He doesn't want her to respond saying what. He wants her to say, yes, babes. They want submission, but they don't always deserve it. I'll see you guys on Sunday. Toodles.